when you start living for other people, when you start living for the fiction of other people, and you're not honest to, with yourself about the fact that you're doing that for your own interests, right? Because we can say, well, I care about other people. It's like, right, because that makes you feel good about yourself, right? So there is, there's still that selfishness there, and that's okay. There's nothing wrong with that, so long as you continue that into realizing everybody else is you, in which case you're always taking care of yourself, so you're always taking care of everybody else, right? But yeah, it, it's... Um, it's just a matter of perspective, right? It's just a matter of getting out of the way. And I find it interesting what you were saying there about it reinforces the illusion of I. Opinion is by far the biggest danger with that. And, and it's something I've wrestled with for years. Um, it's so easy to have an opinion about every experience that we have, but opinion reinforces our identity. If we take it too seriously, like you can have an opinion and be willing to challenge it, be willing to question it, even willing to, to ignore it completely and try something new, or you can hold on to it and then it just keeps painting you into a corner, right? But I think this, as soon as you've got that I in there, right, you're, you're putting yourself in a box. And as soon as you put yourself in a box, you're closing doors and limiting possibilities again. So yeah, that's why it's so important to just keep questioning yourself, questioning yourself, try things more than once. Because you're a different person each time.